You are getting hosed here on both ends. Yeah. That's the reality of yeah. this bet. Yeah. I, I hate this bet because <laughs> if we're talking about a 40 two cent gap sure. on a yes no market which is asinine in itself um as for the question i'd probably go field yeah because there are some concerns about when Benyama's structure sure or his size or yeah. whatever you want to call it i mean chet got hurt last year yeah and chet's built like a paper clip <laughs> which i hope is corrected coming into this season <laughs> what's so funny wait. he is wait last season <laughs> You said he was built like a coat hanger. Now he's a paper clip. I mean, Which one is it's it? It's the same thing. <laughs> Chet couldn't bench me. So I, I hope that he comes out and dominates. But I do have my concerns here. Look, you have Chet in the mix. Yep. You have Brandon Miller. You have Scoot Henderson. You have Cam Whitmore. I mean, I, I think the number here is telling because Paulo Bancaro last year was minus 300 right. to be the rookie of the year. Right. So this number is substantially cheaper sure. than Paolo's number. That's not to say Victor Wembanyama can't be an all-world Hall of Fame player. Sure he can. Is it going to happen in year one? Yeah. I, I don't know. There may be some growing pains there. Yeah, I mean, look, in the field, you get Brandon Miller, you get Scoot Henderson, you get the paperclip, Chet Holmgren. I'm going field here, although I will acknowledge if Wemby is healthy. Kid is special. Yeah, I, I mean, it's hard to deny that. And the Spurs, for all we talk about, well, for all I talk about, I take shots at them and pop all the time. But to be fair, they get these talents like this, and they do develop them sure. into great players. But Brandon Miller could score 20 a game next yes, year. Yes, and Scoot's a baller, too. Chet could get – Chet. What if Chet comes out next year and scores 18 points a game, yep. grabs 10 boards a game, right. blocks five shots a game? Well, That's a stat line that – should be rookie of the year. He better be in that weight room, according to you. <laughs> Benching. I think anything. he's been in there. We need to take him through the drive-thru a couple <laughs> times.